y'all. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, my name is Liz. And on this channel, I talk about handbags, accessories, plus size fashion, and whatever else need I feel to talk about. As you can see by the title, I have some boots for fall that I'll be rocking. And yes, ladies, I have cowgirl boots, cowboy boots, whatever you want to name them. I say cowgirl boots because I'm a woman and I wear the boots. And as you can see, I'm feeling a look. What do y'all think? I have on my cowgirl shirt, my my hat, my sunnies. We ain't gonna leave the sunnies on for the whole video, but I figure I'll just rock them because I love glasses, my favorite accessory. Let's get into the video. Hit that like button, comment down below, and hit the notification bell for weekly uploads. And you can also catch me on Instagram, iStyle underscore Liz. I'm gonna be showing some pictures of at least a couple boots that I have styled in the past of how I worn them. I'm linking some items down below if they're still available. Some of these boots I've also had for a while. So if I can link it, I will link it down below. And if I can't, I apologize in advance. So the first boot that I have is my um, brown fridge boots. And these boots are from Amazon. And the brand is called Not Rated. So these are it. I hope you can see that. I'm going to put some pictures up of me also wearing these boots. And just for reference, I wear a size 10. Um, but some of these boots I did size up because of the pointed toe. So we'll get into that. But yes, I got me some fringe boots. I like these because of the detail they do come in black on amazon and i know they kind of they kind of look indian indian style boots but these are definitely cowgirl boots um i love these these i haven't worn them much but um it has a zipper on the side it has a zipper on the side and these are uh let me see these are a size 10 and I paid $80 for these. And I'm going to link these down below if they're still available. They are suede. They're like the almond toe. So if you're into that, these are great boots. It has not big of a heel. Probably about two inches or less for the heel. And these are comfortable. I mean, I can walk in these for a long, long period of time. So these are called the brown fringe boots you know amazon be having names and stuff for these wet boots and clothing that you never even heard of but again these are my brown fringe boots i am a fringe fanatic i love the detail that's one thing about me when it comes to my cowgirl boots that um i like to have a lot of detail in these and it just makes a statement it makes a statement so I'm hopefully I'm showing the cutaway somewhere of me wearing wearing these boots. And girl, I'm looking to the side because y'all know I have to write notes. I have to, if I don't, I'll be lost track of what I'm trying to say. So that's why I'm looking over to the side here just to keep track of all the boots that I'm going to be showing in the video. So um, the next boot that I have is my red ones. Now I did show these in a haul. Oh, these are dusty. I did show these in a haul, my Amazon haul, and they do come in numerous styles. Um, I do wear these quite a bit and um, it's just different. I like the red. It's a pop of red. Can't go wrong. These are also, let me see. These are a size 10 and I got these from also from Amazon. I'm going to try to link these down below. And the heel is very, very small on these. Now, these are really not good quality boots, in my opinion. Um, I feel like I'm tipping over sometime when I wear these. I don't know if it's the heel or what. But, I mean, you get what you pay for. And I don't, I don't wear these for a long period of time. But these are definitely boots that I do rock and I do wear. And like I said, I got these in a size 10 and they don't have a zipper. So these are pull on. It's kind of hard to pull boots up when they have no zipper. So sometimes I have to size up just for that purpose as well. And so that's these boots, the red ones. My next cowgirl boots, these are my favorite, yes. 
<laughs> these are my new addition to my cowgirl boot collection. And these are purchased from Amazon. Yes, yes, look at these. Yes. Now tell me these ain't bad. Tell me these ain't no statement. All black, all black wearing this right here. Or you can wear this with uh, a knit sweater with some leggings. Oh man, these boots are bad. Anyway, these boots make me so happy. I think boots make me happy, period. But anyway, these boots I did get from Amazon. And I'm going to link the brand down below because I cannot pronounce it. I be done chopped it up. So um, these are also a 10 and a half. And let me put one down. These are a 10 and a half. And I sized up due to them due to them having a pointed toe and also having no zipper. These are pull-on boots. These have no zipper. So I'm happy I sized up. And every boot that I'm wearing, I can wear socks with them. I don't have to wear tight stockings or anything like that or be barefoot. I can wear thick socks with these boots. So every boot that I'm showing are comfortable where I can wear my regular socks with these boots. And um, back to the boot. So... It has a fringe, it has the detailing here, and the heel is not so high on these. I can walk for a good amount of time with these. And that's why I think I gravitate and I love cowgirl boots is because of the heel. You really don't have a high, high heel in cowgirl boots. And I think you have more of an option and they're very, very comfortable. So that's why I think I gravitate to cowgirl boots anyway. So, but... Look at the detail. I got to give y'all up close to her because she is a stunner. I mean, I could even wear this with what I got on now with some blue jeans, some dark skinny jeans. Oh man, this is bad. This is a bad boot. I, I got, I haven't even wore her yet. It's like I have to style her up. And um, anyway, this boot here also, when it comes, it's kind of, wrinkled up so as it sits the fringe does lay out and straighten out but look at her look at these boots man these is my favorite boots in this whole whole collection right here look at these i know i i, I keep showing let me put these boots down because i can talk about them boots all day <laughs> so the next boot is very slick it's very classic when i seen these on amazon i was kind of kind of nervous to buy them because they didn't have any reviews and these are just clean and these are nice. Look at these. These are sexy. These are sexy ladies. Oh man, I'm laughing because I I these boots made me so happy. I can I'm, I'm a boot girl. I'm a boot girl. I'm a shoe girl. I think I have convinced myself to just leave sneakers alone. I think I'm good with like one, two pairs of sneakers. If I can wear shoes and boots. What I would, I, I'm just, I just like the style. But anyway, back to these. But look at these boots. Aren't they beautiful? Now I got these from Amazon and these are a size 42, which is a, a woman 11. And again, I upped the size on these because the pointed toe, the pointed toe, and it has no zipper. So this here is like, stretchy the white part it's like a like a sock and these boots also i noticed that they do scrunch up a little bit but not bad where it's annoying so i did keep them i love these boots i haven't wore them yet i i can't wait to wear them my birthday coming up this next week november 28th sagittarius so I'll be 42. So out of all these boots, and I got more boots in the corner that I don't know what I'm going to put on, but that's here or there. But anyway, look at these boots. I'm going to try to link them down below. These are so sexy. So far, y'all, if y'all liking this collection and you liking my cowgirl boot haul, let me know down below. And also hit that like button. Hit that like button and share the video if that's something that you're interested in and you like what you see. So anyway, let's get back. So the next boots that I have are from Walmart and they're from Time and True. Now these boots are old. 
I don't know if they're still available, but if they are, I can link it down below. If I'm not mistaken on their website, they did have brown, but I think they don't have any more black and no more white. So these are the white ones. And I'm going to be putting a picture somewhere with me wearing these boots. Um, these are definitely boots that I like to wear in the summer. Um, I wear these boots any anytime. And these are also a size US 10. And like I said, I got these from Walmart. And see, they have a zipper on the side. And they're very roomy. It's like an almond toe. And... These boots here are very, very comfortable. You can wear these all day. They actually have cushion in them. Yeah, they do actually have cushion in them. And like I like I said, these are the Time and True boots from Walmart. And the uh, next one is from Walmart too. And these are the black ones. Same style, same cut. It's just different color. Oh my God, I know these boots are like dusty. I... God, I wish I can have like uh, somewhere I can put my boots where they're not dusty. But anyway, here or there. So again, these are the black ones. I got these from Walmart as well. They're the same way as the white ones. I wear these quite a bit as well. So like I said, if that's something that y'all interested in with me styling these boots or showing some looks, I can try doing that with some of the boots. And because cowgirl boots are kind of tricky to style so that's why i also keep the outfit simple when i wear these boots i kind of don't put too much thought into them because then it can look too too western like i don't want the boots to look west like western western i kind of want them to look like street but classic at the same time if that makes sense i don't want to look like i'm about to go ride a horse <laughs> i mean that's that's not my style to look like I'm about to go ride a horse. So, I mean, I just love cowgirl boots. So let's go to the next boot. So the next boot I have is very, very old. Very old. I think this boot is almost nine years old. And this boot I got from Shoe Dazzle. I don't know if y'all familiar with Shoe Dazzle, but I had these boots for years and I am not giving away. These are so comfortable. And these are also pull on boots as well. And, but these are comfortable. These are a size 10 and they are leather. All the boots are leather except the brown fringe ones. Those are the only ones that are suede. And look at the detail on these. For these boots to be so old, look how they just, I mean, they got a little scratches on them, but you gotta expect that they're almost, almost, they're like nine years old. I had these boots for years, but I just figure I'll put them in just show because they're all different sty styles of cowgirl boots. Everything doesn't have to be pointed or anything like that. So this is more of a round toe. It's not so much almond and these are so comfortable. It has like a lining inside as well. So and these are my tan ones. I can't link these down below, but if I can find something similar, maybe on Amazon or something, I'll try to link them down below because um, these are old and I don't even have a shoe dazzle description. Shoe dazzle can be very addicting. So I definitely had to opt out of that a long time ago. And look at the buckle, the detail in these. I, these are so good. That's why we still, we cannot get rid of our skinny jeans because we need our skinny jeans to tuck into our boots in the winter. So it's good to have about one or two pair of skinny jeans because you got to have them for the boots, ladies. So I also have a wish list of some boots. I would like to find some nice denim pair of cowgirl boots. I'm in the hunt for those. I did buy some like from Steve Madden and I, I did buy some from Amazon, but I didn't like the material. So I returned those. So I'm still hunting for some denim cowgirl boots because I'm a denim girl. I like denim. And also I did see some on Amazon that are black and white. I noticed they have some like at Zara. So I was looking for like the dupe of Zara and I found some and they're black and white like with flames. But the only thing is I think they're like faux leather. They're, I think the Zara ones are like patent leather. They're like really shiny. 
man, them shits, I mean, oh, <laughs> them boots is bad, man. But, you know, due to the cost and I'm okay uh, getting the Amazon brand, I'm going to try them and maybe I'll show in the haul another video of those boots, but I'm going to put a picture somewhere of the boots I'm talking about from Amazon and Zara. So I found those. I might get those. Maybe I'll be a birthday gift to myself. I don't know. But I really don't need any more boots or any more cowgirl boots in general. But I do like the flame style. I do like the, the look of them. And it's definitely a statement piece. But anyway, so I don't want to make this video too long. And if that's something that you enjoy, like I said before, hit the like button. Share my video. Let's grow this channel. And um, I hope you enjoy the video. Hit me up on Instagram, iStyle underscore Liz. And comment down below. Let me know if y'all like these kind of videos because I do have a lot of handbags on my videos, but that's not all I um, would like to show. I like, to, I like style, I like fashion, but I don't wanna make videos for no reason either. I know I'm a new channel. Um, I know I'm just starting, but I mean, if ain't nobody gonna watch it, I ain't gonna be wasting time to be filming it. So um, come on, give this video like, let me see, like 100 likes. And um, I, I ready for the fall is definitely my my style fall. I have so many coats. I have so many things to share on this channel. I hope y'all are ready. Um, I wish I can film a little bit more than what I do, but I am full-time worker. I work night shift, um, wife, mom. It's hard to incorporate these videos and make them, but it's something I love. It's something that I enjoy, and I hope to help some ladies out there where Dressing doesn't have to be so difficult. It's all, like I always say my motto, style and fashion is yours. There's so many ways you can style things and style clothes just to make it your own. You don't have to put so much thought into it. So that's why I'm coming here on this channel to show and I just have a passion for it. So like I said, I hope you enjoy this video. And yes, I have my glasses. I gotta put them on to end this video, y'all, because I'm feeling the look, I'm feeling the style, and I want to say thank you to all who's been sticking with me so far. Happy holidays, happy Thanksgiving, and I will see you for the next video, and thanks for watching. And till next time, y'all, bye.